Hello guys and welcome to this new video. In this video I want to do the speed comparison of the Lenovo Duet on the left side to HP Chromebook X211 on the right side. These devices are Chromebook tablets and they both run the latest Chrome OS software on a stable channel. However, they have different CPU and memories. The Lenovo Duet has MediaTek P60T processor with 4 gigs of RAM and the HP Chromebook X211 on the right side has a Snapdragon 7C first generation processor with 8 gigs of RAM. The model I have here has 8 gigs. So I will try to close the apps after I use them so that the performance results will not be affected by the memory differences. In this video, I will go through some real scenario cases. Then I will restart the device. I will open some apps, I will run some video, I will open a game to see how in the real life the comparison of these uh, performance will be. Hope you guys will enjoy this video and as always don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for more videos like this. So let's just get started with turning these devices on. You guys see that HP One was faster. I will try to log in as soon as I can in both devices. The HP One was much faster than the Lenovo Duet. Again, in the comparison to see how the performance of these devices is if you start the device. Now we can continue by going to the settings here. Again, HP One was faster. I will go, go to show you guys the latest software here and you guys see that we are both in the same uh, version of the Chrome OS here. Now I want to make a screenshot and open it using the Files app. To do so, I will come here, I will click on the screen capture here on both of them. And the difference was in the speed was not obvious here, they are both fast. I will make a screenshot. HP One was slightly faster and how it showed the notification here. Now I will try to go to the Files app. You guys can see also how the performance differences and when you open the Files app. Again, HP One was faster. Go to download, click on the app. Again, HP One was faster. These are clear wins for the HP. Generally, they are is a little bit more responsive compared to the Lenovo Duet. I will now try to open Play Store and install Netflix app. I will do this test separately and use the stopwatch to see the speed of this uh, process because if I run them spontaneously, the downloading will be affected and that will also cause error in the results. So to do this, so, I will try to do them spontaneously. And now I will do as fast as I can to install this app and see how long it will take till the open button will turn green here. Let's see. So, 30 seconds to open the Play Store and install the Netflix on the Lenovo Duet. So now let's come to the HP Chromebook X211. I will repeat the same processes here. So I will try to start, search for Netflix, and install, and let's see how long it will take here to do so. So oh, when the open will turn green, I will stop it. So 38 seconds, that was completely different result here. And I think the downloading speed and the Duet is much better than the HP Chromebook X211. That I realized in so many different cases that 
I think the speed in the downloading is better in the, than I will do it compared to the HP Chromebook X211. Now I will try to open the Chrome browser on both of these devices. They are almost the same. Now I will try to go to the large. I will do the same here and now I will try to click on them. Okay, the speed is almost the same. There's not that much difference. Let's see how they're scrolling. They're both actually similar. Let's open one article here. Uh, we can open the camera here. They're both actually similar, so there's not that much difference here. Now I will try to open the YouTube on both of these devices. Again, HP One is slightly faster to open and load the apps. I want to go to the same channel. It's my channel, actually. I want to open this video, so advertisement. But you guys see that the performance to load the page was similar. The main difference, yeah, I will not say main difference, small differences comes when we do full screen. These devices usually suffer from this. Again, HP One was faster. Now I will try to exit this full screen. Again, HP One was faster here. Now I will try to go to the multitasking window on both of these. and also have the, the settings on the right side here. So you guys clearly see that both of them are responsive and it's working quite good here. I don't wanna push them too much because there is a memory difference here. So I will keep it like this, but generally loading the apps in the HP One is slightly faster for the YouTube app. So I will now open a game. I have the Space Marshal 2 to see which one of these devices will load this game faster. So HP One was faster, clearly. I will try to go inside of the game as soon as I can. And again, HP One is slightly faster here. So again, short, small advantage for the HP here. For the last part of this video, I will try to open the Squid app. It's an Android application. It's almost the same. I will not say there is a difference between how it loaded the app. I will try to make a note here. This is a test. It is really responsive. I will do the same here. This is a test. It's also responsive. So there is not that much difference in the pen input and how the delay works it mostly depends on the application and as you guys see the squid application opens almost the same in both of these devices so let's sum up based on what we saw in this video we can clearly conclude that hp chromebook x211 is slightly faster than lenovo duet i tried in, in this video to open some apps open a video open a game to show you guys how the performance differences are and in most of the cases, the HP One was slightly faster. There was one case that HP One was a clearly winner, and that was where we started the Chrome OS in the beginning, when you try to turn on the device. There, the loading, the time for the loading of the Chrome OS was much better for the uh, HP Chromebook X211. There was one scenario where Duet was a winner, and that was where we tried to install the Netflix application. And I think the reason for this is because the loading time is better for the Duet compared to the HP One. So it's not clearly related to the performance and CPU performance. It's mostly about the download time here is better on the Duet. But if you guys ask me if you want to upgrade from Duet to HP One just because of the performance bump, I would recommend not to do that. HP One has other factors which makes it more desirable for me at least, and that's the three by two aspect ratio, which makes it more productive. And also the external monitor output that we have with HP One 
a 60 hertz by with a 2k resolution and that's the case that the duet suffers with the duet the external monitor uh, output is i think for the full hd you get only 30 hertz so that's a problem with the duet one if you want to use it as your main driver so hope you guys enjoyed this video as always don't forget to subscribe and hope to see you guys in the next ones